Your word is a lantern to my feet and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips and teach me in your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever, truly. They are the joy of my heart. I have applied my heart to fulfill your statutes forever and to the end. Jesus, full of the Holy Spirit, returned from the Jordan and was led by the Spirit in the wilderness, where for forty days he was tempted by the devil. He ate nothing at all during those days, and when they were over, he was famished. The devil said to him, If you are the Son of God, command this stone to become a loaf of bread. Jesus answered him, It is written, One does not live by bread alone. Then the devil led him up and showed him in an instant all the kingdoms of the world. And the devil said to him, To you I will give their glory and all this authority, 
for it has been given over to me, and I give it to anyone I please. If you then will worship me, it will all be yours. Jesus answered him, It is written, Worship the Lord your God and serve only him. Then the devil took him to Jerusalem and placed him on the pinnacle of the temple, saying to him, If you are the Son of God, throw yourself down from here, for it is written, He will command his angels concerning you to protect you, and on their hands they will bear you up so that you will not dash your foot against a stone. Jesus answered him, It is said, Do not put the Lord your God to the test. When the devil had finished every test, he departed from him until an opportune time. Lord our God, as evening falls and the light disappears, 
receive our prayer. God, our Father, you look upon us with compassion. Receive our prayer. God, our Father, you take upon yourself our burdens. Fill us with your peace. God, our Father, in silence we are led to you. Sustain us by your word. God, our Father, your love is all we need. Welcome us and all those you have entrusted to us. God, our Father, kindle a new brightness in our night. May your light shine upon us. Holy Spirit, Spirit of the living God, you breathe in us on all that is inadequate and fragile. You make living water spring even from our hurts themselves. And through you, the valley of tears becomes a place of wellsprings. So, in an inner life with neither beginning nor end, your continual praise makes new freshness break through. 